to achieve bcnf in a table we must make sure that the table satisfies first second and third normal form how does it satisfy and how does we achieve bcnf we will see exactly how in this video before proceeding with this video we recommend watching our detailed video on first second and third normal forms in that video we have thoroughly explained each form of normalization with multiple examples to clarify the concepts the video link is in the description now we have two options either we understand bcnf by a tougher definition that has been shown on the screen or we keep a very simple rule in our mind which says non prime attribute shall not determine non prime attribute i think we shall stuck to a simpler way so moving on to our example we have a college table which has three attribute student course and teacher student plus course combines in to make a candidate key the prime keys of the table as for every table this table also has a rules has a set of rules which says teacher can only teach one course and a course can be taught by multiple teachers we will keep this rule in mind we will also look the functional dependencies the first functional dependency is student plus course determines teacher which is all right which does not violates bcnf the other functional dependency the teacher determines course violates bcnf as we determined earlier a non prime key cannot determines or guess a prime key and that's what happens exactly in this table a non prime teacher key determines a prime course key so this table is certainly not in bcnf we also need to make sure if the table satisfies first second and third normal form the table does not have multi valued attribute as combination of the primary keys so so it does satisfy the first normal form the table also does not have a partial dependency means the non prime key just not depends on only a part of candidate key it depends on both the course and the student so the table also not has partial dependency the transitive dependency says non prime attribute guesses or determines the other non prime attribute and in this table there is only one non prime attribute so there is no question of transitive dependency in our table as well now the condition for bcnf is x determines y where x is primary and that's exactly what our table is violating teacher is determining the course so what we can do is decompose the table bcnf decomposition has a rule we will split the given table into imaginary tables r1 r2 where in r2 our attributes will be the problematic attributes of the functional dependency in which teacher determines the course so we will take these two attributes and write it down and and make it a table of it and call it r2 and r1 and r1 will be of a non prime attribute and a prime attribute which was which was apart from the problematic one so the attributes for this table will be student and a teacher so we have decomposed the original table which was not in bcnf into two tables so that's how we end up achieving the bcnf thank you so much for watching please support us by subscribing to our channel so that we can make more videos like this and if you have any video ideas or want us to make a video on any educational topic please write it down in the comment box